Hello ladies and gents and welcome back to Slide 2 Band of Thieves. The last time was my frustration and issues with the bottle run. <laughs> but I did manage to collect all 30 of them. This time we're gonna go shoot things. Cause you know, that's exactly what you need to do after you're dealing with a lot of frustration. Just go shoot things. Okay, don't go up that one, that one's a dead end. We need to be. So you're trying to remember how to get up there with Murray. Cause... Uh... Mm. Oh, I, I did a complete loop around. Okay, that works. Cause... Oh, come on. And by the way, what do we get with Murray? Ah, a turn book a launch. I actually don't remember what this does because I barely use it. No, no, wait. I guess I do. Yes, I do. I remember what this is. No. Wait, you on L1. Put you on L2. This gives Mario a boost. Add on to the. Oh, oh. Ooh, that was close. I almost got burned. I don't know what the goods. I don't know what the goods are doing with lasers. Don't look, don't look at me. I don't know. No. There we go. That chopper is a menace to all future aerial operations while on this job. Yeah, it's all covered in missiles and guns and stuff. Now be a team player and take it out with that rusty pre-war turret. Okay. I had a potato gun once. I bet it works just the same. Because a pre-war turret gun is exactly like a potato gun. Get buttons fast and sure. Shoot strike them. I don't think you need to. Yeah, it's just pick a button and mash. Nothing too difficult about it. Here comes the difficult part. <laughs> Moving. Alright. Shooting things. Oh, Mark. Well, no. We are shooting missiles, so. Uh, I. Also, I just. Well, probably not see. But. I do have. Invert on, because it naturally defer, uh, defaults to. Up equals down, down equals up. Uh, that confuses me to, like nobody's business, so I turned it to invert on, which is up equals up, down equals down. So, if you like things, yeah, I guess preferences are everything. And it's getting a little too close for comfort. Ooh, shorties. They look like glasses almost. I mean, you can take a couple of hits, but, I mean, what's a gamer without a little bit of a perfection record? Plus, you know, it seems kind of get in your face. It makes it a little difficult to aim. Alright. Come here. Come here. There we go. Good. Nice little bit of hit. And as it gets uh, lower in health, the little chopper in the right hand lower corner will get darker and darker red. Indicating. Oh, you are right in my face. Uh, indicating I'm just essentially, if you can't tell by the level, the color will essentially let you know how close you are. Sometimes it's a little hard to see. Ooh, that was a nice barrage. And now it's going to switch up its patterns. And I believe it's, it, it does have a set path every time. I think it'll start with uh, the semi 
three ghost types, and then I'll switch to the big, uh, big circle ones, which, and sometimes it'll send out two that'll crash into each other. I think it's panicking. <laughs> crashed into each other. No, no, you're not gonna hit me. I refuse to be hit. <laughs> you, however, are almost no, okay. In my side note, you notice that uh, the Thievius Raccoonus is what the guys are writing in when they mark their mission complete. Uh, so it's all three of them are technically writing into it, although in a scene, Bentley will be seen as the first official person to write. That is not a Cooper. Uh, let's all face it. Bentley and Murray are, are unofficial Coopers. Yay! Delta didn't see me. <laughs> I don't know how that works, but it worked. Let's see. Jump on this. Jump on that. Oh, come on. I had that. I thought myself that a little bit. Fuck. Oh. That'll work. <laughs> Unnecessary jumping. <laughs> Let's go crash party. Hello, I'm here for the dance. Oh. Sorry, sir, but we have a dress code. You got a tuxedo? Uh, no. <laughs> Sorry, pal. No tux, no entry. Sorry, Sly. Somehow I totally overlooked the need for formal wear. Now that guy's not going to let you in without a tuxedo. Don't beat yourself up, Bentley. At a party this ritzy, there has to be a spare penguin suit around here somewhere. Try the guest house. Eh, let's go get a penguin suit. You earned it. Uh, nah. Okay, fine. Alright. Uh, let's go raid the guest house. Oh, really? A double as soon as I get here? And we're gonna go raid the guest house. <laughs> Oof. Okay, Bentley. I'm in position inside the guest house. Have any intel for me? Oh, well, I recommend searching all the rooms. It's statistically probable that each should hold at least one portion of a tuxedo. What do I look for inside the rooms? This isn't an exact science. Ransack the place until you find part of a tuxedo. Any plan which involves ransacking is okay with me. You heard the turtle ransacking. This entire mission is good for getting coins.
Yes, Bentley. Um, don't forget to pickpocket first. And if you do get spotted, uh, smoke bomb, which will lead to being able to kill the guys easier. This will lead to outside, uh, onto one of the balconies. And just, as Bentley said, ransack. This place is fantastic for coins. And it'll be like everything you hit. Oh, and we got the bow tie. Uh, everything's good for coin. That is not a thing. I can't even raid the bathroom. Yay. Break the bathroom. Get up. I don't care. I don't care. <laughs> okay, how many. How much you scream? Don't forget the pillows. The pillows are destroyable as well. Alright, on to 102. This is 101. Oh, right. Barrels. Barrels you can hide in. You can use it to sneak past the guard. Zzz. Gonna do that. Alright, let's see. Looking good. Do that. And one more. This is a bit more of a reckless tactic, but it does do the job fairly well. And I missed the health. Damn it. Uh, I hope one of these will have it. Anyway, back to ransacking. Do, 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 do. Yeah, is that a health? Yes, there it is. Ha ha. Do, do, do. I think it's over here. Nope. Uh, oh, 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 oh. It was right here. Haha. <laughs> the gloves. Lives. Yep. I'm gonna just break all the mirrors. And of course you can go out of the ballroom by going out into the balconies to get some extra stuff. I don't know if it'll cancel out the mission though if you go outside. Usually they got a good warn. They got a warning sign available, but uh, I don't know. I, I'm more in favor of just getting everything done right now, I'm killing all the snakes. Snakes. Uh, I am skipping this room for and saving it for last. You'll you'll see why in a little bit. Ooh, who's in here? Uh, okay, there's just two monkeys. Oh, goat. Where'd the goat come from? Right here? Nope. We're just gonna do this the barbarian style. Let's see, where was it? Is it this one? No. Keep thinking it is, but it never is. Oh, wait, I think he dropped the help. Nope, apparently not. Ow! That one did. Here? Yep, there it is. The shirt. Alright, uh, you guys can go back to patrolling the room now. I've got what I needed. Do you have health? No, you never have health. Ooh, but he has something shiny. Let's go up into the rafters. No! <laughs> I said up, up, not down! You have something shiny, though. Shiny, shiny! Ooh, good shiny. And run away! <laughs> Alright. Room four. And you are two people. So, do this. Oh, great. I don't have my smoke bomb. No, you were just water. Blast. Alright, 
Now this guy's on his own. Come on. Yep. Hold on. Ta -da. That's where the coattail was. Or tuxedo jacket. Now we're missing is the dance shoes. So that's got some pretty big feet. Shall we go see who has matching shoe size? There we go. Needed that. Alright. Now the one I avoided. Even though he is the lord of the hill and the one who owns the place. This is Rajan's room. Stay sharp. He's probably got extra security. <laughs> Even though this is his palace and all that, he stays in the guest room. I guess it would make more room for the... Was the snake dancing in the background? I could have sworn I just saw the snake dancing in the background. And of course, prime coin section right here. Destroy everything, and you'll get a lot of coins. You could just literally trash the place. What am I doing? Thank you, sir. No, there's nothing under here. Okay. I think that's the next mission. All right. Sorry about that. Let's see. What we need to do is go up. Wrong up. We need to go over and up. Get past this guy. Pickpocket him. And get rid of him. And then over here. Fancy bed. Over here is the shoes. Also, I didn't think Rajan would do the same. Now that you've got a complete tuxedo, the doorman will let you into the ballroom. I honestly didn't think Rajan would be the same shoe size as Sly. I honestly didn't. I could have sworn the tiger was bigger. And well, uh, what is this? This is this is the bathroom. No, no, I'll stop breaking all the toilets. We'll break the chairs though. And apparently the TV. He's gotta get a new TV now. I will. Let's just get out of here. We've got a date with some lovely ladies. Wow. Nature outside does not like the world today. Daisy. And run over. <laughs> this should lead me. Where am I? Get up. Do, 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 do. I am actually back at almost full health. So. Ta da! <laughs> you got your tuxedo now, sir? Of course I do. I'm here to dance. Then come on in. I could have sworn Rajan said that everybody was already there. Apparently this guy did not get the memo. Your tuxedo disguise is working perfectly. No one will recognize you in that outfit. Now, during the heist, you'll need to dance with Carmelita to keep both her and the crowd distracted. The only problem is about dance partners, so you'll need to impress her first. All right, I know just the girl for the job. Constable Neela, you look lovely this evening. I'm sorry, do I know you? I used to chase after you back in Paris. Paris? Sly Cooper? You aren't by any chance here to turn yourself in. Old Ironsides would fall out of her dress. As good as that sounds, how about a dance first? Enchanté.
try to memorize the steps. Now your turn. This is exactly what it looks like. Uh, if you screw up, you're essentially stepping on her toes. <laughs> so, and if you screw up too many times, she'll stop and say her feet hurt. That is, I, I have yet to have the guts to screw up on Carmelita, so <laughs> I don't really know what she says. Are you using me to get at old Ironsides? Yes, I am. Do you mind? Not at all. At least he's honest. Lovely. It also takes a good amount of screwing up to actually to lose this. I'm sorry if I'm being so quiet. I'm actually trying to focus on not screwing up. Nice. Uh, my main way of doing it is just kind of pushing the buttons as they show up. That fellow is very graceful. If only you moved spice shipments as well. Um, silence. Uh, like when they're showing this preview right here, I kind of just get my fingers moving in the motion. X. Yes. Of course, as you can hear, she praises as you keep doing a good job. Black Chateau's music. If I'm remembering this right. End it with a with a dip. Thank you. That was delightful. Thank you, Constable Neela. After all, it takes two to tango. Yes, and three is always a crowd. Neela, your friend here is quite an accomplished dancer. I tried to make him look good. Please, Neela, his skills far surpass you. Perhaps later you and I might share a dance, Miss... Miss Fox. Carmelita Fox. And I accept. Well, we now have a date with Carmelita again. All right, boys, we're ready for the next phase. My plan to get at the clockwork wings requires the use of the electric winch above the ballroom. To get control over the device, I'll need to hack the computers in Rajan's boardroom. Plus, we'll need an extra strong saw blade to cut the wings off the statue. To make a saw blade that durable, I'll need Sly to steal the gems off the headdresses on Rajan's prize elephants. And finally, I'll take to the field with my remote control helicopter and nullify the palace's surface-to-air defenses. That should clear things up for the heights. Bentley, how are your pictures so bright? When this this area is so dark. Let's see. Yeah, yeah we'll end it with life. Despite what Bentley says, it is about time to wrap it up. So, thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. And until next time, my beloved audience, I bid you adieu.